I think the biggest risk or concern that people have about investing is that it's a rigged game. Ultimately, the biggest thing we get wrong is actually the biggest thing that we're addressing, which is, is this market fundamentally fair to all who participate? And that's the thing that we have to continue to emphasize and focus. For a retail investor to trust financial markets, they ultimately have to believe that they have a right to ownership of what society is progressing. And I think that's a very important fundamental value that we'd like people to believe and for them to trust us with. Now, we have to show that trust in turn back to them. In a period of extraordinary societal, geopolitical, and macroeconomic stress, financial markets broadly worked. And I think that's a great reflection of the investments that have been made in the technology and infrastructure that drives capital markets over the last many years. Now, that said, no market is perfect. So we're all obliged to embrace the latest technology, really invest in resiliency and make that a priority. And ultimately, ensure that from the experience of an average investor, that they truly understand how that market works, what are their rights and obligations, and that ultimately their interests are aligned with the interests of those who serve them. One of the most important things we can do as a group of financial institutions is help people interpret their own data for their own purposes. Make it easier, make it more transparent, make it more actionable. The concept of whose data it is, who has rights to it, and ultimately what is the quality of that information is going to be one of the central issues of our time. Allowing investors to invest in a wide range of asset classes that diversify their risk is also going to be a critical step as we think about the longer term. Historically, most retail investors invest in largely traded equities. Fixed income hasn't received the same level of attention. And until recently, private markets have been inaccessible to the average retail investor. Giving that retail investor a broad access with transparency, a clear understanding of the economics and risk, I think it really is the mandate for our, our stakeholder group. Capital markets reflect the best intent of a society. We're gonna tackle our most important issues, whether it's the climate transition, geopolitical strife, by increasing the flow of capital around the world and making sure that it gets to the right people to do the right things that ultimately serve our society. And for people to be owners of their society, they have to have ability to invest in a transparent, fair, and economically viable way. One of the most important things we can do is help set a pathway for our world that is generally based on more inclusion, fairness, and ultimately serving societal goals at the most important level that we can.